Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be doing a tier list of different Canadian cereals, ranking them from best to worst. Starting off first, we got Mini Wheat. They're an okay cereal. They got a nice texture, very crunchy, but I don't know. I'm not a bat massive fan of them, so I'm going to put them in the B tier. Mini Wheats are okay, but not the best. Next, we got Chocolatey Frosted Flakes. Frosted Flakes are pretty solid, and Chocolate is also solid, so I'm going to put that, no, nah, maybe B tier, high B tier above Mini Wheats. They're okay. Next, we got Corn Pops, which are kind of interesting. I'm not a massive fan of them. I used to like them when I was younger, but trying them again, not the biggest vibe. They're, they got a nice texture to them, but the flavor of them is just meh, and they don't taste like actual corn, like sugar. Next, we got Nesquik. I like Nesquik cereal. It's just solid. It makes it taste like chocolate milk, and it is overall just a good chocolate. I think it's better than the chocolatey Frosted Flakes. Next, we got Corn Flakes. I'm probably going to put Corn Flakes maybe above the uh, Frosted Flakes. Corn Flakes is a classic. It's not the best, but it's classic, and you can add things to it. You can see there's, like, fruit in it. I like putting a little bit of maybe sugar or something on top. I haven't had it in a long time, but I remember it is it's pretty solid. Next, we have the Timbit cereal and the birthday cake one. It's pretty decent, actually. It's got the same texture as, like, a Corn Pop does, but better flavor, and the birthday cake flavor Timbits are solid. So I'm going to put that in the A tier. I think there's a chocolate one. Might not be on. Yeah, it's the last one. Perfect. Next, we got Cookie Crisp, which is an interesting cereal. Uh, it's like mini little cookies. They're honestly pretty decent. It's not the most healthy one out there, but cookies taste good. So, yeah, putting that there. Next, we got Special K. I like Special K. It's a little bit healthier than some other cereals. So, I'm going to put it in the B tier above Corn Flakes. Um, a lot of different types of corn or uh, special K. That's just the original. So I'm going to put it in the B tier. It's another one you can add things into to make it a little bit better. Next, we got Crave, which is an interesting one. It came out like a few years back and it's got chocolate on the inside of the pieces, which makes it taste really good. So I want to put that one in the A tier. Weedabix. Oh, oh shreddies. Weedabix. I'll probably put that at F tier. Never liked it. Not really my favorite. Um, the texture is a little off. The flavor's off. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's gotten better in years, but I haven't had it in a while and don't really want to try it. <laughs> Next, we got Shreddies, which ugh, they're, they've they been around for forever, but not my favorite. The texture of them is a little bit different. They got an odd flavor, too. Not my favorite. Next, we got Cinnamon Toast Crunch. This is solid. I love Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I'm going to put it in the S tier, one of my favorite cereals out there, just because of the flavor, the crunch, everything about it is nice. So, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, first S tier. And we're following that up with another S tier. Oreo O's are very solid. And uh, they got that cookies and cream flavor. They're kind of like Fruit Loops, but uh, I find they're a bit more solid than Fruit Loops. So, yeah, putting that in the A tier. Two Scoops Raisin Brand. This is a very, I don't know, not my favorite. I'm going to put that in the B tier. It's got raisins in it. If you like raisins, maybe C tier. Yeah, no. Above Shreddies, but it's not. I used to like it when I was younger, but not my favorite. Next, we got Cheerios, which I, this might not, people might want to put this up higher, but I'm going to put it somewhere in the B tier. Cheerios are decent, but not my favorite cereal. It's, I think there's a lot of different types of cereals. Like next, we got the chocolate Cheerios, which I'll put a little bit higher, but um, yeah, no, there's the apple cinnamon Cheerios, which I like, but everything else is like okay. Next, we got oatmeal crisp. This is another one that's kind of odd. I don't like the texture a whole lot, and the flavor is a bit off, too. So I'm going to put that roughly around there. Another mini wheats, this time in the, um, I think that's the, yeah, original flavor versus the maple. I'll say the maple's better than the original. Mini wheats are just not my, not my jam. Same thing, oatmeal crisp, not my jam. I'm putting that in the C tier. Rice Krispies. Rice Krispies are getting a good ranking because they make rice crispy squares which are delicious it's not exactly like just cereal but they combine together and make a really nice treat so putting that there next we got captain crunch which captain crunch is kind of a i don't know i'm gonna put that in the b tier it's okay cereal uh crunchy but it does destroy the roof of your mouth and i don't like how i feel after eating it so i'm gonna put it in the b tier they do have a bunch of different types of cereal as well but yeah no b tier Next, we have Fruit Loops. I'm putting this in the S tier as well, probably below Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Fruit Loops are great. They kind of, they set up a whole genre of cereal. Like, there's Fruit Loop copycats out there, a lot of them. Uh, the fruity cereal is not, like, everyone's favorite, but I think it's great because it's, you know, it's set up a lot of different uh, 
types of cereal to come out to try and compete with it. And also Fruit Loops does make like different types of food. Like they had gummies before. They had, I don't know, they have a lot of different things. Fruit Loops are great. And they honest for some reason there's a lot of Fruit Loops flavored protein powders. And I like them a lot. So yeah, S tier. Next we got Shreddies Honey. A little bit better than regular Shreddies, but not my favorite again. Uh, going in C tier. Honey Bunches of Oats. This is kind of the same kind of boat as all these. They're okay, but not ones that I directly go for. They're like maybe old people cereals. I don't know how to describe it, but yeah. Next we got Cocoa Puffs, which I might put above Captain Crunch. Yeah, somewhere around there. Um, another cereal that just destroys the roof of your mouth, but it tastes good. Chocolate flavor, kind of similar to Cheerios. Yeah, they're decent. Shredded Wheat. This is... Yeah, putting that in the F tier as well. Not a fan of that. It's kind of similar to the Weetabix. Um, not a great texture, not a great flavor. Yeah, not a big fan. Next, we got Lucky Charms. They're after me, Lucky Charms. I'm going to put that in the A tier as well. It's got marshmallows in it. You can buy just the marshmallows if you want. I don't know. Solid. A tier. Apple Cinnamon Cheerios. These are the best version of Cheerios. So that is going in the A tier. They're better than those two there. Uh, most classic Cheerio flavor, I believe, and they're very popular. So, yep, A tier. Frosted Flakes, again. Um, maybe below the chocolate ones. Frosted Flakes is classic. A lot of people like them. They're very similar to Corn Flakes, but I find they're a bit too sugary for my taste. So, yeah, I'm going to put those B tier. Honeycombs. Ooh. Maybe below, like, somewhere around there. I'm not a massive fan of it. It's another cereal that just destroys the roof of your mouth doesn't have a like fantastic flavor to back it up either so i'm putting it there honey nut cheerios is the i think the most popular version of cheerios i'm not fanatical about them but they are good so i'm going to put it with the rest of its brothers in the b tier next we got sugar crisp which i've never been much a fan of i'm just going to throw that in the uh c tier low c tier um it's again another one that destroys the roof of your mouth not the best flavoring in my opinion Ego, this is, I, I like it, I like it, I'm going to put it in the A tier, it's uh, different, it tastes kind of like the Ego waffles, and it's got like that maple leaf flavor to them, yeah, maple syrup, it's solid, I like it, um, some people might not, but that's fine, and Reese Puffs, I think Reese Puffs is another S tier cereal, they are so solid, and I think it got worthy company in the S tier there, Reese Puffs, solid peanut butter flavored cereal, the best one on this list. Finally, we have the Timbits Chocolate, which I'm going to put right around there, just below the birthday cake Timbits. I like them. Um, crunchy, nice texture, um, solid chocolate flavor. I think they did a good job with these. So, yeah, there it is. Canadian cereals ranked on a tier list. Best to worst. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Fruit Loops, Oreos, and Reese Puffs, my favorites. Um, I think those are very solid picks for S tier. So, let me know what you would place these in the comments below. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.